for coffee and music number 1403 right here in Sioux Falls South Dakota I'm traveling back from Dillon Montana after making a pair of boots with Schwartz custom boots here yes what an experience what an experience a two-week boot camp making a pair of boots and wow i'm so happy with how these turned out i can't stop wearing them they look so cool and i'll give you a closer look here after this first song on monday here for coffee and music number 1403 i want to start out with one shot good morning lucas good to see you let's do this how's it going dj good morning nick How's it going, Freddy? Good morning, George. I'm coming off the trail with Wyatt, Bat, James, and Virgil, and we were thirsty for some whiskey, but had not a penny to our names. My boots were too dusty and my muscles too tired to sit with some inbreds and lie through my teeth for a few card games so the other four boys got a table and I moseyed on up to the bar. They often joked there was more silver on my tongue than in all of Tombstone. I said, barkeep, we came in only with our guns and good looks. We ain't good with the broom, ain't good with the books, but a drink would liven up our weary bones. What do you say? He said, empty your wheel gun out on the bar and we'll see how many rounds there are. Yeah. One side four, one side then I only deal in 45s. One side, the whole lot and that leaves you one shot for your life. But I looked at the bullets, but I looked longer at the bottle. As much as I hated to part with those five rounds, lost for taking chances. So I told the boys we had a deal and they all came up for their drinks. Then my eyes stopped at the stairs and big nose Kate and now we're exchanging glances. Last time I saw her was when the rangers took me from her bed. But she helped me escape before they could put a rope around my neck. She walked on over to where the mouth breathers were playing. One spotted a curse at her. I guess they weren't playing with a whole deck. Oh. I said, you got one shot to apologize. Or I'll put one shot between your eyes. One shot for one shot. And I only deal in 45s. One shot. It's all you got. You got one shot for your life. Then he said something dumb like he don't apologize to whores. So I figured he was asking for all the things that would come next. I still had my whiskey in my hand when he reached for his gun. But he was all wrist and it's all hips, so I kept my word a la tete. Then I was empty, but I hadn't spilled a drop. His friend made a move, I was quick to my knife. He knew he'd been beat by the shine of the blade. I finally drank and said, give me your bullets and I'll let you leave with your life. Well, before he ran, he let them fall to the ground and I bought the boys in caves another round. <laughs> one shot for one shot and I only deal in 45s. One shot. All you got, you got one shot for your life. Yeah, it's alright now. One shot, one shot. One shot. Happy Monday to you guys. How's it going? Good to see you, Nate. Good to see you, Carlos. Hey, Neil. Good morning to you. New boots got soul. Yes, indeed. How's it going, Ricardo? Good morning from Brazil. Yes, what are the boots of the day? What are you guys kicking off the weekend? Let me know right now in the live chat. Freddie is rocking some Black Cherry Dan posts on this Monday. I'm rocking my new 
custom boots that I made over a two week period in time. Check them out over at Schwartz Custom Boots in Dillon, Montana. If you guys are interested in cowboy boots at all, what an experience and it's totally worth it. So check it out. These are the boots that I made over the last two weeks. Bison foot, American Buffalo foot. Uh, a green kid skin top 15 inches tall I inlaid my logo in there got a nice white collar up here as well of course the Buffalo poles two inch heel check out how undershot that is isn't that cool isn't that so cool love the uh, cutter toe style here or what is called in the uh, custom bootmaker world a this is a one and a quarter box toe pretty sweet huh pretty sweet what an experience guys just finished them up as you can see uh, the Schwartz's Julia and Dan signed it in on the inside uh, along with myself boom loving these boots loving these boots and I got videos to come that you guys will see the whole process I'm gonna do an extended test for them and everything it's gonna be sweet Lucas is rocking a JC BNV collab boot today that's what I'm talking about yo that's what I'm talking about. Nate Messler is rocking some horsepower 9502s. Yes, good choice. Thank you, Michael. Thank you, Duderish. Isn't the underslung heel that underslung heel? You gotta love it. So classic. So punchy. So cool. <clears throat> Man, a lot goes into a pair of boots. Custom pair of boots, and after being in the factory. Uh, down there in Leon, the Los Altos factory. And now doing this, I get like a complete rounded out perspective of cowboy boots and I can't wait to share that with you guys. Hey Fran, how's it going? You've always been interested in the circumference of a boot shaft size D or double E of smaller calves. Uh, so 3 8 inches is best. It's going to differ between how how wide a shaft is, how wide the tops are, compared to the size of the boot is going to be different depending on the, uh, on the manufacturer. So lots of area is really wide, Dan Post is pretty wide, but Fenolio is pretty, um, is pretty narrow. So if you're looking for a narrower top, Fenolio is a good way to go. Should make a square toe. This is the square toe. This is the classic square toe. Right here. That's the classic square toe that the custom boot makers make. Ruben, it's the way to go. Yeah, buddy. Thor's Mike, good morning to you. Wearing smooth ostrich today, Fran. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. You guys are stepping strong. Love to see it. Cheers to you guys. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. What uh, what what vibe are we needing? What uh, what mood are you guys in for songs here, on this beautiful Monday? I'm streaming here from Sioux Falls on my way back after an awesome boot camp at the Schwartz Custom Boots shop in Dillon, Montana. Duderish is rocking some rough out Anderson beans. Whew. Yeah, buddy, that's what I'm talking about. What are the travel plans now just to go back? So I stopped at Carter's Boots uh, on just, I guess it was yesterday or the day before. I guess it was yesterday. Stopped at Carter's Boots and um, just to say hi to the Carters and do a couple of in-store videos there. And the Hondo 2670, AKA the Jeremiah, is the only boot that's sold out right now. So they got a spot for it on the shelf and it's sold out. So thank you guys for buying up all of those Hondos, 2670s, the Hondo Jeremiah uh, from Carter's Boots. Completely sold out, but they do have 30 more coming. They have 30 more of that boot um, on order and it should be arriving soon. But uh, I am just headed back, just headed back to Ithaca, pretty much Pretty much a straight shot. No, uh, no, 
no uh, no detours or stops <clears throat> just because after two weeks or almost three weeks with all the travel got to get back at it got to get back at it you want some western tunes all right let's see <clears throat> let's see how about two drovers oh you want carl's view you want the carl's view song i could do that I could do Carl's View. I'll do Carl's View, and then I'll do a quick, and then I'll do another Western song real quick. <sighs> Carl's View it is, thanks for the request. Thank you, thank you, Lucas. up on the hill you should come too and we will see the stars from Carl's view up by his stone we will lay in the grass with every glimmer we glimpse the past come on everybody let's set new heights each other if we all look up tonight I'm going up on the hill you should come to and we will see the stars from Coral's view there is so much more than what we can see ain't there some humidity just try to focus and count them all Well, we're not alone, but it makes you feel so small Take note of that moment Make hope inside That we could even be together With your hand in mine Going up on the hill You should come to And we will See the stars from Carl's view Back and up Chill out When we imagine What is possible We forget the fickle crimes Of the constable Yeah, there's a long time Coming and a long time Gone through our space, there's an infinite dawn. Now stop, chill out. <laughs> Man, my dog is barking here. I'm in the dog park. And <laughs> sorry about that, guys. <sighs> she wants me to throw the ball. She's like, stop playing the damn guitar and throw the ball already. One more here, and then I gotta get going, hit the road again. Two Drovers is the Western song for you. How's it going, Jeff? Thank you, Thor's Might. Thank you, Lucas. <laughs> Naka, no. Chill out. Jovers. Good morning to you. Well, I found myself in Boise in the springtime of 16 when two well known famous drovers come a walking up to me. 
Saying, how you doing, young fellow, and how would you like to go? Spend the summer pleasant on the trail of the buffalo. Well, me being out of work right then to the drovers, I did say, if I may be bold, I haven't told all the buffalo have gone away. But if you pay good wages and transportation to and fro, I guess I could go with you on the trail of the buffalo. Mm. <laughs> of course we pay good wages and transportation too. If you'll agree to stay with us until the season's through. But if you do get weary and you try to run away, there'll be no one else to save you and you'll also lose your pay. So with all their flattering talking, they signed up quite a team And the papers treated them like the only two drovers on the scene Our trip it was a pleasant one, as we hit the Westwood Road To find success at behest of these two here that drove But then our pleasures ended, and our troubles soon began As these two drovers argued over views of food and hunting land so the team split up into two even halves and started fighting over everything that came up on our path as we all had feared the time of buffalo had ended even though one said that it could be great again and so they changed the game they changed the rules and the fear we all thought of the future, but it was no longer clear. When the working season ended, those drovers had made up and explained under smiles the team's fighting cost too much. So with all the season's pay, the two turned to go, but the team arose to leave their bones with those of the buffalo. two drovers thank you for joining me here on coffee and music after my custom boot making trip at schwartz custom boots check out the boots one more time here these are the ones that i made over this two week adventure to dillon montana and i am headed back headed back here today um going through sioux falls this morning and about to get back on the road to Ithaca, New York, so I can get back at it. Because being three weeks away, I am definitely a little bit behind on the videos and everything. <laughs> All right, guys. Love you guys so much. I will see you guys around. Let's kick ass, take names, and have a little fun. Thank you for joining me here on Coffee and Music number 1403. And I will see you guys tomorrow at some point. Who knows if it'll be in the morning or in the afternoon. But I will see you guys at some point on Instagram for 1404. Love you so much, and I'll see you around. Cheers. Have a good one, everybody. Let's go.